What's going on guys? Welcome back to DCS World and my tutorial series for the A10C Warthog. In our last video we learned how to cold start this bird, but now we're gonna get it to do what all birds like to do and that's actually get it flying. Now, uh, first we need to do make sure our canopy is closed. Mine is, because I hot started this bird. We are going to make sure our nose wheel steering is on because unfortunately we need to take this airplane off from a runway. We're not a helicopter, we can't just take off from right here, as cool as that might be. So what we're going to do is we need to taxi to an active runway. We're here at Abu Dhabi International Airport. Uh, thankfully we don't need to taxi very far. There's an active runway right in front of us, so we're going to advance the throttles a little bit until we start rolling. And we're gonna use our rudder pedals to steer the airplane on the ground so you see we can steer it right and left. And just get it rolling forward here along the taxiway line. We don't wanna to go too fast. We'll use our wheel brakes to slow down here and make this turn. Just trying to follow the line, keeping it to about maybe a five or ten knot taxi. Okay, and there's the runway just ahead of us, so we'll taxi forward here. We're going to be taking off from runway 31 left at Abu Dhabi International Airport here on the beautiful Persian Gulf map. That's not the runway, that's a taxiway. The runway is actually right up here. I do have stores loaded on this plane, so I'm gonna be a bit heavy. But that's fine. Okay, we're going to taxi into position on the runway. Get her lined up with the center line and come to a stop with the wheel brakes. Quick before taxi checklist, we want to make sure our anti-skid is on. We're going to set our flaps to maneuvering, which is one tick down, About uh, it's about 10 degrees of flaps or so. We're going to make sure our takeoff trim is set. We've got a button over here for that. Right below the SAS switches, there's a button here labeled takeoff trim. Press and hold that for two seconds. That ensures our takeoff trim is set. And we are basically ready to go. Runway is clear ahead of us. We've got our clearance if you know we were talking to ATC. So what we're going to do is we're going to hold the wheel brakes. We're going to advance the throttles to 100% full, hold, and release the wheel brakes. So we're starting to roll. We're using our pedals or our rudder control to keep ourselves center on the, on the uh, center line. Our airspeed is coming up. Above 80 knots, nose wheel steering comes off. There's 100 knots, 110. Still using our rudder to stay straight. 135 knots and ease back on the stick to rotate the airplane up. And we're flying. We'll bring our landing gear up. And we'll continue climbing with flaps maneuvering until we hit about 170 knots. There it is, so flaps coming up. And we're flying. We'll 
use our trim controls here to make it a little easier on us here. And we're flying. We can make a nice gentle turn out to the right now and go do our mission. In the next video, we'll learn how to land. So I'll see you then. Until then, take care.